beep, beep. What's up, YouTube family? I'm coming home to the Philippines. Philippines. Coming back home, my homeland, my place of birth, where both my parents are from, where majority of my family is from and still lives. The Philippines, guys, it's a place I've always wanted to go to as an adult. It's been 25 freaking years and I'm coming back home. I gotta say, I'm very grateful and blessed to be able to take these solo trips with the business, with the little family. I'm gonna miss y'all so much, Nyla, Nathan, Abby. I'm gonna miss you guys so much. To all my clients, thank you for letting me do me. To my team, KP, Jay, thank you. But whenever you get a chance to go to your homeland, you gotta take it. Tomorrow's never promise. Enjoy the vlogs, team. Peace. The Los Angeles airport. You ever see celebrities here? Sometimes. Yeah? I Who? I don't even know they know. <laughs> you just see them in the movie. Yeah. You see athletes too? Uh, yeah, a long time ago. LeBron James doesn't come to here? Seen him like twice. No way. Yeah. That's good. That's amazing actually. La Brown James. This is a big airport, eh? Not really. No? Philippines. We gotta wait more in line? Yes, sir, for the immigration. In the Philippines. In the Philippines. Look at all these wheelchairs. Everyone's got wheelchairs. Everyone's on the wheelchairs. Look at this, y'all. We made it to the Philippines Manila Airport. First stop. Fresh coconuts. Oh, that's, that's, that's oh yeah. Nice. Oh wow, they get a big container like that? Then after we drink it, he cuts it and we eat it? This is sick. Oh, right away. Oh, that's proper. Um, how do you say it? What's that word again? Macano. Macano? 45. 45? Yeah. <laughs> 45 pesos. So that's like $1. Yeah. $1 and for all, for all. 10 cents. Okay. Uh, it's a Niagara Falls t-shirt. Nice. You have family in Canada? Thank you. Salamat. Cup. This cup. Look how, look how Norbert's riding. Cheese! What's up, guys? I'm here with Norbert Torres, PBA basketball player. And, uh, oops. We're getting haircuts today. We're going to be getting haircuts. What's this mall called? Beagles. We're at the, 
We're at the Green Hills Mall. We just did a little shopping. You know, we have this basketball game tonight and we are probably going out tonight a little bit. So I gotta get fresh. That's for sure we're going out tonight. For sure we're going out tonight. Gotta get fresh. After this win. After this win, you hear it all? Hello. Oh, okay. Anyway, Sorry to hear me. Nice to meet you too. Yeah, yeah. You got a haircut here? No, I'm still about to get one. Oh, nice. Oh, okay, You've yeah. been here before? Yeah, I've been here before. Okay. Not this one, but I know this chain. Yeah. Oh, no, no, oh, so it's, it's a franchise. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's a wild one. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Can I pay for two haircuts? <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Okay, so this is, uh, <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta just no, check off what I want. Your name, sir, just your name. Oh, uh, this. Very Client's <laughs> contact yeah. number? Yeah, this, I know, same, same one. It's Canadian. Salama. Uh, six, six, eight. Salama. Uh, it's for two. I'm gonna pay for yeah, two haircuts. Okay. Oh, you I'm. I've been. I only have one available partner. It's okay. He's next. Okay, sir. Did you He needs a cut. He needs a cut. Oh, oh, he was ahead of me. Oh, you guys were here first, she said. Yeah. Okay. We we came in last. It's okay. Jerry, it's okay if I video take my haircut. Oh, thank you. <sighs> All right, guys. So we're at Bruno's franchise. Thank you, thank you, Puya. Bruno's Barber Shop is a franchise here in the Philippines. As I was saying, I got a basketball game to go to today, and I'm gonna be watching this guy right here. So I gotta get fresh. I'm getting a taper, a high taper. Let's see how they do. I have no clue who my barber is. I, don't, I haven't seen any pictures, but I'm trusting him. Let's see how good it is. Busy today, Jerry? Not so much. How long, how long have you been a barber? Four years? Oh, 12 years. Okay, so you know taper. Taper fade. Is that what you call it in Philippines? Taper fade? Mm -hmm. So 12 years, all right. Day one, day one in the Philippines. Fresh clothes, fresh haircut. Reunited. No, bro, how long has it been, bro? Yeah. How long? Since that's been like six years, maybe seven years. I can't even. I can't remember when I saw you last. Like, it feels like it feels like it was like seven years ago. I, I, no, we saw you at um, Niagara, Niagara, man. Remember that? We're shooting in Niagara? Niagara downtown? You, I just saw you randomly with your brother and your sister? Oh, with my sister, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but with the family. Yeah, but I, I seen you, yeah, I seen you, but I seen you that trip, during that trip, I think, no? Yeah, that was the one. That, I just randomly like, saw you in Niagara. Like, seven years ago. Yeah, but we never chilled. What's the last time? We usually hang out during Christmas or New Year's. Yeah. I mean, New Year's. No, what they do? No, Christmas. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, we see each other on Christmas Day because we. I remember we'd watch the, some of the, the last, the last Christmas game. Yeah. Oh yeah. So, no bringer. We used to go to his house. Maybe like, we did this like for three or four years. We'd go to his house, or his brother's house. Sometimes my place, and we would just drink. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what video Kenneth has though? When we are we're hooping with Matthew. Oh, in the court. That was that was one of the right funnest days. The yeah, yeah. Yeah, at my uh, city of Brampton gym, you can rent it out. That was funny. Well, what's the the 
here. Tell, tell me, what did we used to do at the movies? Oh, man. The biggest finesse in getting us free movies. The whole day, we spend the whole day at the movies. Right? Yeah, we we'd uh, we bike ride to the movies. We'd bring food. We bring food, and then we would uh, watch like three or four movies. I would finesse it though, because I would know all the times, so we would know which one to watch first. <laughs> yeah. How much is a pedicure manicure? You know the price. I don't know the price, I, I just take the pay. What is it? Uh, it's not something. Uh, what I'm saying, like, I might. You're gonna cut? I might. I, I actually purposely didn't cut my nails. Oh, you'll get the money. It's actually thing. like, I might as well just. <laughs> <laughs> I might as well just do the whole thing. The full service, huh? Foot spa with name cleaning is any time. Oh, that's a foot spa. No, no, I just need it. Yeah, just manicure and polish. Oh no, manicure and nail cleaning. Okay. Yeah. So I'll get that one too. So and then he's gonna someone's gonna cut his hair after. Thank you. Yes. manicure, pedicure, sir. You too? Pedicure. No, but you too? You want a pedicure? No, I'm okay. You sure? I think I need to save up for the game. Oh, you need long nails. <laughs> Scratch people up. Is it rough here? It can be. The PBA? It depends on who. This game probably is rough. I think I seen something on YouTube. Did, did, did you go into a little scuffle? No. No? Okay. Oh, that was Matthew. Sorry, sir. One sec. My hat fell. Matthew got in a fight. Yeah, that was the US one. Yeah, that was crazy. That was too. You guys went on the news and everything. Like we were down like 40 or something, down like 30. You guys were all over the news. Andre Blotch. The crazy thing was they got like money for it still. Like they still got bonus money. Matthew? The whole team. Why? Just because, I don't know. No one knows. But they were all cheated like they just kind of kept the game. <laughs> they weren't, they weren't like, the, no one was mad at them, like the president. Yeah, they just fought back. Filipinos are known, right? So that's good. If they didn't fight, they probably would have got, uh, yeah. Did Matthew get some blows in? Uh, he he almost, I think he almost landed at the, at the end. Because like he wasn't on camera really. He was the one who started it, but... He tried to go after the guy who started it. Mm. On, uh, no, Matthew started it? No, no. He didn't, but he tried to, he tried to get the guy. Oh, tried try to get the guy who started it. Okay, okay. There you go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Jerry. Yes, sir. When you guys say 2-5, that means like 2,500, right? Yeah. And because the ladies like one five, okay, I get it. What about handshaking? When you see people, is it is it the same as like all over the world, like slap and then props? No, no, no. I think they already handshake. Actually. It's not like like I saw your friend. I hugged him. Oh, fist bump? Because of COVID, no one wants to hug no more. No one. You know, you know the handshake where you bring it in? Yeah. That one? Yeah, they don't do that. They don't do that? What about the girls? Do you kiss them on the cheek? Yeah, I can do that. That's all I do. That's all I do. Yes, sir. That's the one right there, Jerry. I like that. Yeah, getting a high taper. Do 
You do girls' hair or just men's? Men's haircut or women and men? You could do that. Uh, we have stylists, but uh, here in our brands, uh, we don't have stylists yet. Okay, so you cut the women's too? No, no, no. Oh. Only the stylists cut the women. Oh. So you just cut men? Men yeah, only the men. Oh, I like this. If your barber doesn't use this shaver right here, when he does bald face, he shouldn't be your barber. Does the 400 pesos include this a little shave or no? No shave, right? Yeah, it shaves different. Shaves more, right? Yes, yes, yes. Not out anymore. Hold on, I want to grow my beard actually. Oh yeah. I'm gonna be fresh for your game, fam. Oh yeah. This is sick. I like how you do that. I love Filipinos so much. Like, I love Philippines. I've only been here for less than uh, 12 hours. I'm in love. This is this is where I honestly feel like they need to be. But by the beach, fam. You like the beach here, sir? Which beach is your favorite in Philippines? Philippines? Well, we have our, uh, a lot of beaches there in uh, Cebu. I am from Cebu, sir. Ooh. My mom is in Cebu right now. So you like Cebu? Is there a lot of um, schools in Cebu? Yeah. It's, it's, it has everything there. No, no, uh, no fast food though. No, no McDonald's. Yeah, Jollibee's. In Cebu. Even by the beach? I want to live by the beach here in Philippines. But still, no, bro, you have to take a plane to see me if we're gonna... It's not a problem. Yeah, it's like 50 bucks. The pandemic made things more peaceful, but everything's more expensive now, right? Yeah. Inflation? Did inflation hit the Philippines too? Mm -hmm. Too much, a lot, right? In the city, at least, in the province, maybe not so much English. The province, maybe. <laughs> Oh yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Are you going to Buracay Island? Um, I have to decide because I, I only right now I only have two plane tickets: one for Mindanao and one for Bapalawan or Buracay. So I have to choose. Where would you go, Palawan or Barakai? Uh, I know too much people there. There's too much people? Yeah. So it's busy, busy. Busy. Palawan's more peaceful. I need. I want. I want. I want more peaceful, relax, tranquility. Palawan. Yeah, I think Palawan.
this. I just landed from Canada this morning at 4.30 a.m. after 28 hours of traveling. 28 hours? Yes. So you can imagine my head is a little stressed. This feels so good. Oh yeah, two stops. Philadelphia and Los Angeles. Six weeks. But I want to live in Philippines. I love it here. I've only been here for like maybe seven hours. Seven hours. I got here at around 4.30 a.m. I love it here. They even lost my luggage. They lost my luggage at the airport. But I'm not even, I'm not mad. Jerry, thank you so much. You. So relaxing. Thank you so much, Jerry. I will. It was a great. This is a great day one experience here in the Philippines. Thank you for coming here in Oh, you're welcome. I'm so glad I came here. This is so good. Wow. Oh, I tell you, that feels so good. How's that haircut, no bird? Thanks, fam. Freddie Van Fleet. Darren Williams back when he was young. Oh, that was incredible. That was an awesome, luxurious haircut. Jesus. Oh, yeah. My God, what an amazing experience. Bruno's. Guapo. Guapo, guapo. This guy. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh. 
Oh yeah. No, no, no. I no. cut that myself. <laughs> All done? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Salamat. Oh. Thank you. I appreciate it. That was amazing. Okay. Let's pay for the haircuts. What? Yeah, no. give it to your, give it to your people. What are you doing? Give it to your people, man. I pay for it. What? What is wrong with you? No bird. Get the next one. Get the next it's one. It's my dream. Get the next one. Oh my god. Oh my god, no bird. This guy. This guy. No bird snuck one on me. Here, more freaky Jerry. Hey, thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you. So, actually, I'll take the receipt. I want to see. Salamat. Thank you. Bye-bye. What's up, guys? So, look at this haircut. Look at the haircut. I love it. Very, very nice haircut. So, in total, we, we got two haircuts. I got a head and back massage and a pedicure. And it came up to 1,500 pesos. Man, I love the Philippines. Can you services? It's amazing. That was amazing. The massage too, that was nice and hard. Was the girl massaging you Yeah, she massaged my feet. But yeah, so. Now I'm fresh for the gig. I shall see y'all at the game to watch this guy right here.